We still are. I'll kill them all. <laughs> Matthias. Matthias. So, Matthias is wanted for a string of murders. Matthias Lund is a dangerous individual. Fight Matthias Lund with War 270. He's a level 4 champion. What on earth does that even mean? A level 4 champion? Reposition or something? 192 goddamn damage. Jesus Christ. Hello, we're about to play War Tales Part 12 of host, Matthew. So, last time we finally finished the fate of Tiltren. Literally, everything has been done. I don't even know what to do next, to be fair. I feel like I need to either head to here to go to the border crossing to meet your client, or I need to go to the Moorheim Tavern to meet with the companions. So I'm guessing these are the new regions that I can go to. But before I do that, I need to defeat Matthias Lund. I just, I don't know why, but I, that kind of needs to be done. It's going to vex me if I don't do it. So I feel like I need to do it now. Before also we do that, let's quickly rest up. No, actually, I'm going to go in. I'm going to go in. Bear me here. I got this. Talk to the healer. Let's heal everyone up. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. The chunk. <laughs> Okay, everyone's been healed. I might get rid of one of my companions. I'm not even sure how many companions you can have, but I got a funny suspicion that the fights are scaling with how many companions I have. Because when I had like four or five companions, there was literally only like four or five people, and now I've got like, oh, how many have I got? One, two, three, four, five, six. And now I've got eight. I feel like the, yeah, the kind of, the encounters I'm facing are a lot more hectic, a lot more frantic, and a lot more people involved to kill. So, I'm actually gonna get rid of Worm Toss, I think. The Spear Guy, I mean, I haven't tried this out yet, but I feel like he's probably gonna be better. I kind of immediately regret taking every time the unit ends and the turn next to an enemy and not engaging in combat, you gain one. Since the Spear's got loads of range on it, I feel like this is not gonna happen that often unless I actually force it to happen. I probably should have taken someone like this when I'm next to an ally or probably the kill one. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. If not, I'll just replace the spear guy with another spear guy. As soon as I find another spear guy, good enough to replace this spear guy. Spear guy. So, how do we get rid of this guy? Worm toss. Um, how do we do it? How do I dismiss you? I want you gone. I want you gone from my sight, not to be seen again. How the fuck do I do that? No, I don't want to give you a new name. I want to get rid of you. What's this? Strength and Dex and Oh yeah, I forgot you had a trait. Oh, does everyone have traits? Well, you got blood first, dude. Oh man, he's even got critical hit increased by 3%. This guy's a beast. He's an absolute beast. I need to get rid of him as well. How do I get rid of people? I feel like that should be a thing. Is there something I'm missing? Can I get rid of them inside the camp or something? Right, let's just leave this screen because I'm sure no one wants to see me in that screen for any longer than I have to be. Depart. Okay, let's walk outside. Let's camp up. Let's grab some of my crap from the camp as well. Because I forgot I can do this without resting. So let's grab the... Uh, which one's the camp? Iron, the logs. Leather, this. I'll take some of these daggers as well. So my torch is gone now. The coal as well. I don't know why I need the coal, but I'm taking it. Get rid of that marsh. Uh, yeah, take that as well. Let's take some cloth. You never know when you might need some cloth. I'm literally just going to take everything for now and see what I can make inside the uh, town. Um, so, can I dismiss people from here? There must be a way of doing this. Here we go. Here we go. Manage companion. Worm toss. <laughs> Goodbye. Yes, I do. Goodbye, my friend. Goodbye, my lover. Okay, so worm toss is gone. I just feel like he's really underperforming. I mean, his stuff was pretty crap. But in theory, he was pretty crap as well. So, I thought I'd change your armor around. Did I not do that? You cannot equip light armor on this. Oh my god, just that with really crappy stuff. What about the uh, scout? Where's the scout? Ranger, whatever it's called. One of the rangers need an upgrade, don't they? That's definitely an upgrade for you. How about Astris? Astris got about the same on. Okay, let's put that on you then. There you go. Now you can look as cool as Astris with your stupid bow haircut. Right, um, okay, let's go back in town. Back in town we go. I don't know why I just clicked on there. Tavern. I wonder if we get another spear guy now. Are these the same people from before? I'm pretty sure they are. You look very familiar. Yeah, you're the same people from before. Okay, um, and you? Did I already look at you? You're another spearman. Oh, yeah, you have run, didn't you, instead of the fury. 
Uh, ooh, strength increased by 5%. Is that better than crit? I need to keep an eye on the traits as well when I get people next time. So I've not been paying attention to that at all. Right, uh, what was I doing? Oh yeah, making stuff at the blacksmith. Master Hulans, Forge. Hulan, okay. Bam. And then we can make rags. How much do I need for that? I can forge this. Wait, did I really make this? Have I, have I made this? How do I, I'm so confusion right now. I'm so confusion. Thick skin, 3% base guard. That's really shit. Someone's supposed to be doing damage. Yeah, okay, let's make the claymore. So confirm. Uh, weapon. Iron claymore. See, I couldn't even make the bow even if I wanted to, so it's kind of a good thing I got rid of worm toss. It's kind of a bad thing I took the long bow, though, because it's just going to really put me behind a tiny bit now. But it's the first time I'm playing, so mistakes will be made in a first playthrough. Learn how to forge. Oh! This did not come up last time I did this, so now I'm actually getting a tutorial. The metal plates are heating. Press uh, left mouse button when a plate is red hot to forge your item. Press left, left mouse button when the metal plate sparks to forge an item of superior quality. Hit all the plates at the right time to forge an item of exceptional quality. Yeah, it's not going to happen. Let's go. Dunk. One. Dunk. Two. Dunk. Three. Dunk. Four. Oh, right, I see. Okay, bonus complete a superior quality item. So it's not exceptional, but it is superior. So it's better than a kick in the mouth, you know? Or a kick in the teeth, shall I say. So I've crafted that. Did I get anything else that I can make? I could probably make the shield, actually. For, no, no, no. The other guy's using a hammer now instead of a shield. Um, anything else? Is that it? I think that's it. I don't really need any more of this. Can I make torches? That'd be cool if I could start making torches. Okay, let's equip that on time before I forget, which is very easy to do. I see the damage increase. Uh, so strength increased by six. So that was that's doing 14 damage with that on. And with this one, it's doing nine. Okay, it's gone up by quite a bit by about fuck maths, quick, quick. People are watching. It's gone up by about five damage. Yeah, quick maths that was. Extremely quick maths. Probably the quickest maths I've ever seen in my life. Right, so um I need to sell more crap to this guy, sell that, sell this, sell the bow. What the daggers? Pretty sure there's nothing else I can sell here, but I might buy some more of this. How much is my payday? 136. Okay, yeah, let's make make. Let's buy a couple more. Like a couple more I mean about 15. Right, so we have bought everything we need to. Maybe I'll buy one more medicine as well. No, it's so expensive. It just does not feel worth it. I'm probably just going to stick to crafting that. Gold is really limited at the beginning of the game. I don't know what it's like later in the game, but at the moment it's very limited. So let's depart again. And let's camp up. Probably going to need to camp anyway in a second, but I want to make sure that everything is in... Oh, do I have enough food? Where's my bread? Bread 10. I don't know if I've got enough food. Hopefully. Border pass needs to keep that on me. Um, leather, get rid of that, get rid of that. Did I run out of salt? No, I didn't. I can actually make stuff. Yeah, maybe I'll cook some more uh, bread then. Uh, bread then? Bread then. Put that there. 27. Don't know why I'm not dragging it. I'm doing it like the hard way. Uh, I need to keep that on me, don't I? No, I don't. No, I don't. I can actually go back to my thing anytime I want. Anytime I want, baby. Without any penalties, I think, which is nice. I don't think this is ticking down while I'm in here. Uh, let's put that there as well. No, let's get the cider out. What am I doing? Mushrooms to keep out as well. Grease. Oh, I can make this, um, use this to make torches. Okay. Iron. I need more ingredients. Stuff. Stuff and fangs. Yeah. Sort my weight. Yeah, this looks good. Okay. And then we go to cooking. Then we go to Bedard. Oh yeah, I forgot. I was going to change the names as well. Because they're really shit. Let's make 12. 12 bread, please. Nice. Bonus failed normal quality item. So I've turned into Apprentice now. That means I can cook better stuff. Can I equip these as well? Only one of them. Mutton stew. Let's do it. How do I do it? Right click. Learn. Boom. Oh, right, I understand now. So I can learn it early or I can find the recipes in the wild. So when I actually made that um, 
I'm going to grab that longbow using one of my star points here. I probably shouldn't have, unless I really need that upgrade, because that's just a kind of a waste. I could have put it in here to give myself um, um, something something good. I, don't, I can't see anything good in here. Maybe this weight training thing. Yeah, that's, that was probably better than the longbow. Oh, well, you live and you learn. Okay, so let's head over to Matthias. Where is Matthias? All the way down the road to here. I'm actually scared to face this guy. I feel like he's absolutely going to annihilate me. And annihilation is never good. Never good. Have I got a point to spend? No, I don't think I do. Okay, now we need camper ready. Can I inspect this? Nope. Rest. I command you. Okay, so let's click on... Oh, can I tinker with anything, actually? I didn't even check that. Nothing new. Oh, yeah, I keep forgetting to make the strategy table. I need wood, though. I need eight wood. I bet I've just used it all in making that long sword. Yep, I damn well did. Okay. <laughs> Fucking hell. Can't make this shit up. I'm not paying attention. So I've got a lot of bread. Should I just use that? It's quite heavy. Gives me critical damage. Well, I probably need that. Use that, that, that. Uh, one of those, one of those. Yeah, these guys are getting pretty hungry. Like, really hungry. They're hungry guys, hungry hippos. Okay, let's rest up. I got wages to pay? Fucking hell, I've only just paid you guys. Jeez, greedy for food and you're greedy for wages. I got two Valor points from that as well. I swear like I should be getting more than that. Two out of ten. It's really savage. Oh, this guy's really far. Hopefully, though, oh, don't get me, Sheriff. Hopefully, I can probably do that. That's gone up to average now. I think that was easy before. Um, if I can't take down Matthias, maybe. Or maybe I go do that first. I don't know. I feel like Matthias needs to be done, though. He needs to be taken down. Soap mine. I've already been in there, haven't I? This is so far away from my actual uh, objectives, apart from this one. Okay, so are you guys like travelers? Do you say anything? Hello, Octelia. You have snow irises. You also have raw materials. One of these are worth stealing. Suspicion's fairly low. Let's use you, because I don't know how long I'll keep a hack it. Oh, fuck. That actually puts up by a lot. If I attack them, I can get it anyway, can't I? Oh, but I'm about to fight. Look how many civilians there are. <laughs> Tons of them. Literally a whole caravan. Why is that so expensive to steal that? I'll just take these then. Oh, I don't know. Maybe one of these? Holy shit! You're not currently wanted by the guard. Okay. Oh, because it steals all of them at the same time. Right, cool. I can give them bread and get influence. Now I'm cool. You guys just got thieved. Thieved good. Okay, let's head down to Matthias. Matthias, Matthias. I'm stuck. Are we there yet? We're getting close. Sheriff's on the way though. Need to make sure we don't run into him or them, wherever they are. Your recent actions have caught the guards' attention you are now wanted. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. It goes down off the wall though. That's kind of good to know. Wait, what does it say here? Theft in Buffy Caravan. Theft in Lund Farm. I I didn't steal anything. I don't know what the fuck they're on about. Okay, so they definitely want me now. There's Matthias. Thar he blows. Can I sneak up on him? Is this just one of him? Sneak attack. Lucilla, I'll kill them all. <laughs> Matthias. Matthias. So, Matthias is wonderful for a string of murders. Matthias Lund is a dangerous individual. Fight Matthias Lund at reward 270. He's a level 4 champion. What on earth does that even mean? A level 4 champion? Right, so Matthias Lund, 159 armor. 146 HP. Massive movement. Lucilla's revenge, targets an area. Look at the cone on that. Jesus Christ. Uh, deals 158 damage to all units in the area. And knocks them back by 6 meters at the start of the next turn. But the Scylla's judgment applies judgment to nearest enemy. They've got uncontrollable. This unit cannot be engaged or knocked back. Right, that's great. I've got no Valor Point generation at all. And he's got guard as well, 30%. Right, let's see if we can take down that guard first with Tywit. Let's walk up. 
and give him a smack in the nuts. Boom. And another. Boom. Okay. And I end my turn. Okay, so he's targeted Tywit. I think... This guy does a bleed. Target loses 12, 20% of their max health. This guy's got a lot of HP. Let's do that. Bleed him. Bleed, you filth. Bleed. Let's run away. Okay. Okay, targeted. So far, so good until he hits someone. How much damage do you do? 158. Fucking hell. It's probably going to hurt. Um... Um, 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 um. Let's run you in. Stab. Yeah. And then let's run you over. Ah, uh, Christ, that cone's so big. I'm so scared of being hit by it. Run you back a tiny bit to like there. Or maybe here. I've no idea what he's gonna do. And you can run in. Go for a big boy swing. 25 damage. Boom. And then I'll run you over here. Let's try and get everyone away from this massive cone in case he decides to like reposition or something. 192 goddamn damage. Jesus Christ. This guy is insane. So he's targeting Harusmi next. Jesus. So he's literally going to walk up and smack him and kill him almost. Absolutely insane. Uh, okay, let's put the spearman up here. And that's, uh, yeah, it should be okay. If I stab and stay here, I get a valor point. So we'll walk up, targeting, and I think he gets to go straight away. And see you later, horse me. Okay, so he's been targeted now. No one is safe. No one. Um... Fuck, you're gonna be hit as well. What is this? This guy's crazy. He's crazy. Let's go here. Uh, no, wait, here. I got two points out of that. There we go. Save the day. Not really, but I saved the day. Move over here. And then your turn. God. I kind of want to walk down here to save this guy. Okay, Tywit has been saved. But I don't think I can do damage now. Yep, I can't do any damage. Okay, let's move there. And turn. See what he does. Okay, he's targeting. Okay. Okay. So you can move quite far. I'll move over here. I'm gonna heal this up. I need so much more valor points. Let's run over here. And stab. For more poison. And turn. I think as long as he keeps hitting one, I can keep people up. But if he starts hitting more than one, I'm really fucked then. Really fucked. Okay, you. Walk you over here. First aid that. Then I think I can just walk up. Stab it in the back. I get a battle point from this while I stay here. Yeah.
Right. I think it's safer to move you in. Go for a swing. Look how much HP he has left as well. Absolutely insane. Let's move this out again. Okay, smacks that away. Judgment on Hackett now. He's got a double attack coming up. Okay, so if I were to heal this. Oh. Not close enough, apparently. I'll move there. Heal Astros up. Then I walk down here. Like there. 25 damage smack! There we go. I can even walk away a tiny bit. Yeah, I might do that. Right. But the problem with moving this up is that something might die. Okay, let's move you up. Smack him. Does barely anything. Uh, I just don't trust him. I'm going to move here. Okay, he's targeting. He's going to smack straight away. Okay. Everyone getting swatted one at a time. Now he's targeting that. Um. Oh. Can't he just run over here and heal that? But you also need to heal that as well. All my healers are dying. It's not good. Um. Also need more Valor again. Run you here. Stab for nothing. Get a valor point. That's so risky. Let me just see what happens when I move here. How much movement that takes. Okay. I think I've got enough to run out again. So slice. Finally onto his proper HP apart from the dots. I'm gonna move this back. Okay, targeting. New round, okay. Oh fuck. I can't even say both of them either. Um I think stab. <laughs> Wait next to him. Got another turn. Another turn. I could actually just swing here. And I might as well. Oh, I could run and heal. Puts everyone in danger though if I do that. Let's see. If I move there. Yeah, it takes most of my movement just to do that. And puts everyone in danger. Why am I start slicing him? Slicing dice. No, I think to move back and just take the hit. Yeah. Okay, he's targeting that way now. Not sure it's a good thing or a bad thing. All right, you can run in. Heal this. Run behind. Stab him. Another stack of poison there. Doing 22 damage now. Um, 
I'm going to run over here so I can reposition to heal that. Hopefully he doesn't go for this afterwards. He goes for that. Okay, smack. Nice, okay. Kind of nice, but not. Targeting that. Shit. Shit. God. I'm actually running out of heals for some reason. I could try and go for that taunt. Should I just try to see if taunts work on this? Means I lose all my valor though. Wait. I don't have any other way of getting valor back if I use my taunt here. Why I do, but I don't. Um, let's just run you in instead. You pretty good damage. 12. Okay, let's run you away. Oh, actually, not run you away. I'm going to put you there. Yeah. And you. When you close, go for smack. Run you away. Shit, that's too far away. You've got belly in the movement. Okay. Nice, switched. Right. You're dying. Let's run this up. Slice. So close to killing him. So very close. I wonder if I can bait him to go for this target here. Instead of that one on the right. Can't be too close for the cone though, just in case he decides to chop them both up. Move here. Oh, you don't even get a turn. I die if I move there. Move you there. Oh no way. He's going for a double kill. Um. Okay. Okay. He's really low. He's so goddamn low. If I were to move here. Stab. He's pretty much dead. Yes. Oh my God. That was intense. Laddie, that was just, that was insane. That was what level was I supposed to do that on? That's just <sighs> 10 gold. I got a legendary mace called Lucilla or Lucille, a warhammer of a handle wrapped in human skin. The first name Lucilla is clumsily engraved on it. Whose skin was this anyway? Fucking hell. So I got an epic weapon from that, but at what price? I feel like I need to sit down off that. I am sitting down, but I feel like I need to sit down again. You just complete the mission fight, Matthias learned. Report to the emissary to claim your reward. Report to the bloody morgue or something, or the the infirmary. Fuck me, that was insane. All right, let's see who can equip this then. So intense. You can take that. Is it worth you having it though? I wonder. Where's my warrior? Can't use this type of weapon. Oh, Christ. So wasted. So very wasted. Level four as well. Obviously you can't. You need swords. You need spears. 
So yeah, Bedard is using this massive hammer. The only problem with this hammer is that it does so much damage, but it literally can't be used to the next turn. This unit is readying a skill and cannot be engaged. I think that's how he gets his points, isn't it? Yes, it is. Oh, it's so powerful though. I, I kind of want to keep it on because it's so powerful. Hmm. Start the next turn. I could use it at the end of the turns, I guess, to do a massive hit. 35 damage. And this hits for 12. I mean, the AI is not that clever. And if I lock them down with engages, I think I can make use of this. He can reposition as well with charges. I'll try it out. If it's really crap, I'll change it. And I should probably equip to the dagger here as well. There we go. Oh, there we go. And onto you as well. I've literally like handicapped myself here almost. Not having these throwing daggers on. Right. Oh, fuck. That fuck was so insane. I actually can't believe we killed Matthias Lund. I'm in absolute shock. So that's an average fight there, an average fight there. This one's also next to a lighthouse I haven't been to. This is also next to something. Oh, oh, I just don't have the resources for this. I'm really low. Oh, um, I could repair a bit. Who should I repair though? You, wait, 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 wait. Damage taken doubled. Damage taken doubled. Damage halved. Will power reduced. Will power reduced. Okay. Um. <laughs> that's not good. It's not good at all. Let's repair this. I don't think my tanks got hit. That's kind of good actually. So they take the most to like kind of repair. You got like barely any armor anyway. Do I dare? No, I don't. I'll repair you though. Yeah, I feel like something like that's good. That should be enough to uh, take this down. Right, so rats or whatever this is. Rats are slightly further away than this. But I kind of want this. Yeah, boy. Yeah, that guy was an absolute beast. Literally, I, don't, I honestly don't know what level I'm supposed to be to do that. But I'm pretty sure. What, what level am I? My highest is level 3. And I got, like, I got level 2. I'm pretty sure you had to be, like, level 5 or something. I don't know. That was just insane, doing that like that. Ugh. Ugh. It's like, sometimes it was fun, but at the same time it was just like, oh, it was a bit too much. But maybe because I was really unleveled or undergeared, one or two. So we've got, you reach level two in the Crime of Chaos Path, bonus access to Mother Ducker. I was reading that, bonus access to what? To what, pray tell? What are you trying to show me? What are you trying to tell me? Nothing of relevance. Okay, I think this bar went up though a bit. I think. Hello, friends. I thought you were supposed to be an average. They're level fucking four. Nothing could be worse than Matthias Lund. Matthias Lund. He is actually a beast. Absolute beast. Yeah, this is more like it. More the HPs I like to see. Right, so. Um, oh, you got that big hammer, don't you? <laughs> Shit. Okay. Um, Warder, Hoodlum, Poacher. This is going to be annoying more than this side because the poachers are weak. So let's keep you there, yeah. Let's bring you over here to tank this side. You to fall back a bit. You're taking double damage as well. Wait, who isn't taking double damage? Oh, fuck, fuck the Rangers. Hmm. Okay, maybe something like this for now. Okay, I need to kind of use this guy at the end of the turn. Let's 
switch them. Oh, I don't know if I switch them over or not. I'll leave it like that, actually. Yeah. Okay, I'll send this in. On the hoodlum. Yeah. Bam! I really need to upgrade that club. What level is that club? <laughs> it doesn't even have a level. That's how low it is. There's no, there's no level. Uh, I'll weakening blow this as well, I think. Yeah. I can get loads of valor back anyway now. I hope. Right. I want to save you. I definitely chose the wrong ability on this. Um, walk in the smack with that. I think I can probably just do this instead, though. I'll run in. I'll stab. I'll run away. Yeah. Don't do it, Archer. Don't be a hero. No one likes a hero. A hero. Okay, at least I'm engaged. <sighs> what bastard. Have you moved yet? Don't think you have. I'm waiting for the end of the turn. I want to get both of these in that massive hit. Um... Right, the tank should be okay. This is annoying though. Because he can jump in that as well. Um, I'm going to run over and help it out. Or help him out. Stab. Throw knife? Yeah, might as well. For the four damage. Yeah, in turn. Where did you come from? Bastards. Oh, it's been really hard to walk up and smack you now. Unless. If I run up, I'm going to force him to attack me. That's quite a lot of damage now, that charge. Damn. Yeah, boy. Yeah. <laughs> Cleavage. I'm doing it. Targeting. Now one of those uh, weird guys that don't really do anything each fight. I'm hoping that's not the case for my guy. Okay, tie whip. This guy shouldn't be able to move very far. No. I'm going to run this back. Over here. I just need to not be doing stuff. Okay, 24 damage crit, nice. Oh, five damage. Oh, tickles. Tickles. Yeah, let's go for the tank. Well, poison's going to get a bit nasty, though. Oh, fuck. Yeah, whatever. Oh, the crit on myself. <laughs> Fuck it out. I'm gonna run over here. And I'll get a valor point from this as well. I definitely put the wrong ability though on this guy. Cause I wanna be behind people, I think, not like standing next to them. How? Stop it. Let me kill you. Okay, at least he walked into it. Oh, surrounded, okay, okay. They wanna play rough. They wanna play rough. I think this is going to move out, isn't it? It's so going to move out. Fuck. Let me hit you, please. <laughs> I need to keep them still like a fucking rope or net or something. <laughs> Let me hit you. Let me do it. Right, let's... Um, let's finish this bad boy off. And then... I think he needs some backup over there. I'll send a Tywit instead. To cleave up. Send the Ranger over here to help the tank. Oh, wait. I can actually take my turn now. Boom! Oh, 
Oh my god. That was awesome. Oh my god. That was literally insane. I loved it. I loved every minute of that. And I feel like I just charge through here. <laughs> I came in like a rare kimbo. <laughs> Fucking hell. Targeting gonna get he's just gonna move out of the way though. But that was that was awesome. <laughs> yeah, he's definitely gonna move. Oh he's gonna try and move, wait. Yeah, he's gonna try and move. <laughs> oh god, I feel like it made my day. I felt like a horrible grueling battle. That was a, that was really satisfying. Yeah, that, that was good. That was like an orgasm. Yeah, a really strong one. Okay, so... I think we need to help out here. Bit of cleavage. Bit of cleavage. Okay. I can chop something as well. Chop, chop, chop. Nah, I'll walk out. Don't do it. I said don't do it, you bastard. And he did it. I'm still dueling with this hoodlum. Might as well use this now. Oh, actually. Do this here for the surround. Surround sound. Stab. Big hit there as well. I can get a dagger throw here and kill it. No, I can't. I lied. Maybe it's smoke screen. Yeah, smoke screen's pretty good here. Bam! Will Smith slaps to the face once again. Slap to the face, I meant to say there. <laughs> um, okay. Let's see. Knife throw. Hmm. I'm just gonna put him there for the valor point. Okay, you're gonna try and kill that. I think. Wait, your turn's next. Okay. If I just move this up a tiny bit, go for another weakening blow. Got the engage there as well. Now I can use this. Galvanize. The power of the Valor Points compels you. Okay, end turn. Now I can just go crazy. It is time. The time has come. What's going on over here? Oh, yeah. I remember now. Um, Poacher takes its turn. Okay. Let's walk up and let's go for another cleave. Cleaving is believing. Okay, so they're engaged. Did you have any guard, actually? No, you didn't. Oh, but you swing everything, don't you? Kind of. Yeah, that should be okay. Don't want to be so cautious with my stuff, but... No, nah, I won't be, actually. Got so many valor points. No need. No need. Walk up here for the surround. Stab in the back. Did I just break that? Oh, shit. That's not cool. That's not cool at all. I'll go for this round again. Get another valor point. No, he's moving out of the way. Who would have thought they can move out the way of stuff? Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Right, um... Poach is next. Then you. I think we need to deal with this now. Chop, chop. Do you even need that? I think I'll just do one of these. And then walk down here casually. Hello, friend. Chop, chop. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, he's out there. And then... Rough. Bam! Split in half. Okay. I'll wait. Oh, 
Oh, I wouldn't do that if I was you. You silly sausage. Okay, we'll walk this up. Because I got galvanization as well, I got damage boost by 50%. You still as revenge as well. Okay, end turn. End turn. Uh, shit, it's gonna take some damage as well from this. <laughs> I'll try and heal up. And you. Yeah, we go. End turn. You can heal this up a time. I don't know if this makes any difference to like the overall injuries I get. I doubt it. I think it's like probably whatever you got hit by, it's probably where your, all your injuries can be taken, as in the maximum HP, not the minimum. I don't know, something like that. Okay. <laughs> New round starting. Here we go. Okay. So I've got Galvanization, Lucilla's Revenge as well. 53 damage. Here we go. So on 30, no, 38 plus that, 44. Yeah, 44 HP. Here we go. Boom! 53. I swear like I hit harder before, but that's still pretty cool. Still pretty damn cool. So what armor here? Outlaws, Holbuck, Gold, Lock Picks, Iron, and Coal. So that completely backwards, but it's all good. Oh, my horses level up. What they can do that. Continue. So you reach level three in the trade and wealth path. Bonus new mission. You have completed the mission free old lighthouse. Report to the embassy to claim reward. Go to the Strom Cap Tavern to meet with a mysterious client. Okay. Nice. Very mysterious indeed. Medium armor. So who can put that on? Who is the chosen one with the medium armor? You've got light armor on. Oh, that's quite a big upgrade. Medium. It's where it goes up to 3%. Hmm. The guard goes up pretty high as well. And you. What are you wearing? Heavy armor. I think this is way better still. There is no guard on that. Oh, there is guard on that. 21%. Guard's pretty good. Um, let's put that on you. 37. And... You can have this. Can I even wear that? Outlaws. Yes, I can. Oh, that one's actually better anyway. Tywit's got the crap stuff. It's wearing light armor, actually, Tywit. Maybe I should put that on to... Asterisks. That's a bit better. And then Ash just can put her tunic on to dun 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 hack it. Is that the same one? Yeah, his ain't broken though. His ain't broken. What are you wearing? Are you wearing a little crap as well? Oh, you can't equip light armor. What kind of armor can you wear? That is really confusing. Just basic stuff, like rags and shit. What kind of spearman are you? Let's look at these level ups on the horse. Um, carrying capacity increased by 20. This unit can now fight and wear armor plating. What's better? Work pony or fighting pony? <laughs> what is actually better than that too? So if I turn the pony into war pony, I'm guessing that will scale up the enemies as well. Because there will be more people in combat. So I feel like I should probably just increase the constitution. So I get more carrying capacity. And make it into a work pony. Yeah, sorry, Mefu. No fighting today. Do the same with this one as well. Oh, um, let's do strength instead. Strength. Work pony again. Do I even need both of these? That's so much carrying capacity. I'll probably get rid of one of them. How much food do you take up? Four. It's quite a bit. It's like one bread. Is that one bread? That's one bread. Oh, maybe I should keep two of them still. Hmm. Hmm, the choices, the choices. Where am I anyway? Oh yeah, I remember now. So I'll pick this with you. Let's do it. Oh, maybe not. Oh, oh. Fuck. Come on. This ain't going well. 
my Fallout 4 days are over and Fallout 3. Come on, don't break. It's gonna break. Fuck. Nine left. Been slightly hasty. But we got there in the end. So we've got cabbage, carp, and beans. Nice. Great haul that was. Anything else? Oh, another one. That's just. Oh, fuck. Should be trying a bit more careful here. Trying a bit. Yeah. No. Okay. Damn it. It's going a lot better than the last one. I think I used four on the last one. This one used one so far. I think I spoke too soon. Yeah. Concentration in my face right now. There we go. <laughs> Shit. Oh, Outlaw's chest piece. This is sick. This chest piece has been modified to absorb the most treacherous blows. Movement minus two. Fuck. What's this? Damage increased by 5% if not next to an ally in combat. That's interesting as well. And a knowledge burke as well. Ooh. These are some good finds here. Anything else? Any other beautiful things for me to steal? Mm, doesn't look like it. Okay, let's equip that. I've got a point now. Let's have a look at this armor really quick. I think onto the tank you shall go. Slight upgrade. Guard's better on that still though. Armor is actually not that much different. But it's not minus four movement, it's minus two. Um, so how much movement you've got now? You've got ten. Medium armor. Kind of equipped heavy. What a loser. Heavy. Kind of equipped heavy. You can, though. Wonder if it's worth. Putting that back on her. Oh. Put this on him instead. And then put the medium armor on someone else that actually needs it more. Uh, 36. Gives me more crit on that. Crit's actually quite needed on you as well. I can give this to someone else. That's only level 3 though. Armor 22. Armor 36 on that. Oh, the crit's nice. The crit is nice to have. Can anyone else use this? That's going to make the decision for me. You can. Yeah. Uh, let's just put that back. Oh, Armor's just too good. 3% crit's pretty nice though. Guard increase, 2%. The armors are so nice in the battles. It's a shame you can't equip anything. Kind of dire. Right, so damage increased by 5% is not an excellent ally in combat. That will normally be the ranger, pretty much. Let's put it on you. Put it on you. Animal accessory. Oh, crap. I mean, yeah, that kind of sucks. It's not something I can really use because they don't even go in combat. I'll keep it out so I can sell it, I think, because I don't think I'm going to use animals anytime soon. So, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to part 12 there. We have lots of cool things coming up. We've got go to Stromcat Tavern to meet with a mysterious client. Go to Border Crossing to meet with your clients. And we also have to go to the Mahayan Tavern to meet with the companions. Lots of good things coming up in part 13. Take care.